The V50 is one of the last Volvo projects to borrow mechanical parts from Ford. It's closely based on the previous generation, Focus, so it shares many of the same successes and failures as Ford's small family car. There isn't a massive amount of space for a start. While Volvo might have a well-earned reputation for great estates with loads of room, it's not the V50 that created it. While the boot doesn't have any annoying intrusions from wheel arches and has a low loading height, it's narrow and quickly fills up. Nor is there vast amounts of room in the rear seats, particularly if you have bulky child seats to fit in, but it's adequate. Up front, both driver and passenger should be able to get comfortable, however, with lots of adjustment available for the steering wheel and seats. Controls are laid out clearly. The buttons on the steering wheel access many functions and are large and easy to use. But some of the buttons on the floating dash with its small area of storage space behind are tiny and easy to miss hit. If you specify satellite navigation, it will also take time to get used to the steering wheel mounted controls. Equipment levels are good, with even the most basic V50 coming with climate control, all-electric windows, alloy wheels and an MP3-compatible stereo, all as standard. Since it's based on a Ford, the V50 is pretty good to drive, with taut body control and plenty of grip. Wind noise does build up at motorway speeds, however the diesels are a little noisy and the ride is also a little too firm. The entry-level 1.6-litre petrol is best avoided, but the drive e-diesel of the same size is OK and has low emissions. The 2-litre diesels are an ideal partner for the estate, and while the 2.5-litre turbocharged T5 petrol certainly makes for a fast V50, it's both expensive to buy and run. Resale values on most of the range should prove to be better than average, while build quality feels good. Sensible engine choice will give sensible running costs, and there's also the option of three years fixed price servicing. As you'd expect from Volvo, safety is a major focus for the V50. It scored a maximum five stars in Euro NCAP crash tests and has stability control fitted as standard. The Volvo V50 is safe and secure, but not the most spacious of estates.